Prophet Peter Abiola Debisi is a Nigerian inspirational Christian leader, a prophet, an author, and the founder and president of Christ Miracle Church Mission, CMCM, and champions of fire ministry with the international headquarters in Lagos. Prophet Peter Abiola Debisi was born on Thursday, January 15, 1963, to Mr. Tijani and Mrs. Tejumola Debisi, both late now, in Ibadan. Nigeria, but he is a native of Ilarnogun, Oshun State. He was raised by Muslim parents who struggled financially for the major parts of their lives. Though the ancestors had been part of the royal family in Ilarnogun several decades back, a position where Abiola has used his anointing and the grace of God upon him to restore the family and indeed the lineage back. Abiola studied at the Ohio State College of Arts and Science, Oscars, now called the School of Science in Ileife, Ocean State. His intention was to become a lawyer, but God had another plan for him entirely. He was a rascal at school and loved to play football, thus nicknamed Algeria. And as a young person, he takes pleasure in moving around with his friends who find it difficult to leave him because of the generous way he treats them, always willing to share things with them, even if it's the last meal, even if it's his last meal. Again, prior to the prophetic calling on Abiola, he had shown such inclination at several instances, telling people what will happen to them in a particular situation and time, and it came to pass exactly as he had mentioned. But he was blind to his own gift and was simply satisfied with just enjoying his youth to the fullest while nursing the ambition to be a lawyer in the court of human justice. In the year 1987, Abiola encountered the mighty God and was called into the ministry of the prophet by fire. He saw the heaven opened and fire descended upon him. God spoke and said to him, I have given you the power of Peter. The prophet is married to a delectable and amiable pastor Mises for Lashadi Olatumbosu at DBC, his beloved sweetheart whom he married on the 16th May 1988 and they are blessed with children. Make welcome Prophet Peter Abiola at DBC. Oh, yeah. 
Scream and say, yes! 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 Can I tell you something tonight? I am at home. I am at home. This is my place. If you see me tonight, see me as a member of God's Commission International. Can you hear me? Say a leg bomb Okay. You will shout like this. Devil, you are in trouble tonight. I can't hear you. No, but I say tonight. Devil, you are in trouble. On top of it, let your enemy hear your voice. Shout and jump and say, Yeah! What part of the way? Yeah! Brother, and you what make lion to be deeper? On to your monkey, can you yato? Lies in his voice. Oh, do lori oh, hurry. When lion roar, you got the king, you babu ramu ramu. What happened to the other animal? King, I wanna call you go your share. Roar like a lion tonight. Say yeah. Babu ramu ramu, we can repay. Yeah. That is the voice of God. Oh, a lot of near. Anytime you visit God, everything about him is yes. 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 If you wish, you can make me whole. Yes. Can somebody hear my voice tonight? If you can hear my voice, so my boy, jump and say, yes! Yeah! 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 Let me, let me shock you. Jack, if you're here, yeah, let Before I came up here tonight, you can talk about your kid, one year, or let you. 
My father in the Lord has laid his hand on me. Baba, I mean, what is that what Baba lay me? So I am I am intoxicating already. Can you hear me? So tonight I can see a miracle happening in the life of someone. I can see a miracle my father in the Lord. Baba, I mean, you Thank you. I say, for bringing me into this progressive altar. Don't you beg me? What's in you? Pepe, to guy. The Lord will keep you. The Lord will be with you. Along your work, Beluyi, your double boy. The Lord will bless you more and more. Along your book of you, you bear law. All the pastors. Eh, you know, I say, Along. Thank you. Choir. Thank you. I say on football. All the Thank you. I say Modupa. Every member. Go where you may join. Including me. I see any pelu. Any pelu am I joining me? If you want me to preach tonight, oh yeah, clap your hands. Tomorrow can was. Oh yeah, part. I want part. I want tomorrow can was. We are shall lay. Part. I want tomorrow can was. Father, we thank you for what we're about to do tonight. This is another night. A night. That you are going to demonstrate whom you are. A night of healing, a night of miracle. A night of deliverance through your world. Father, let it be tonight in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, we are up to Jesus. Yeah, have your seat like a king and queen. Have your seat like a king and queen. The Bible says he has made us king and priest. Remember, you pay if you ask your bar at your more bar. And then we shall reign. At you pay your job on the earth. Glory, Lealaye. So sit down like a king and priest. God bless you all in Jesus' mighty name. Yeah, tonight I am preaching on a message. That I was called for. The team says, loose him to and let him go. Who is ready to be loose like me tonight? I can't hear your voice. I have told you there is a power in your voice. As a man thinker in his house, so he is. Can you hear me? I said tonight, I am going to be loose. I am ready to be loose. I to be loose. I am ready to be loose. I to be loose. I am I am Do you know what? The atmosphere of this environment has changed. Why? Because there is a gathering of the children of God. Here. And something will happen tonight. John chapter 11, verse 43. I so much believe in the word of God. That is what I am living for. And brethren, let me tell you. 
Through the word, there is nothing you cannot get. And there is nothing you cannot change. John chapter 11 verse 43. When you read it, it was about the story of a man called Lazarus. Who was a Lazarus? Lazarus. Lazarus was a friend of Jesus. Lazarus or Jesus. Do we have friend of Jesus in the house? Today? Oh, no matter what you are going through. If you are his friend. Jesus might come late, but he, he will never come too late. To them that I've been thinking and worried, I've been coming to, the, to this program. Wednesday program, Tuesday program, Monday, Tuesday, Friday, but nothing has changed. Jesus can come late. But sure, he will never come too late. He will never come too late. So, here, me, Lazarus was brought back to life. Do you understand that? The Bible says Jesus ruled like a lion. Which means there is a time that you must rule like a lion. Lazarus! 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 Comfort! And the Bible says he came forward. Why coming forward? The Bible says he was tied. I am standing here tonight as a servant of the Lord. With the grace of, the, of my father in the Lord. I am standing in the name of Jesus. Wherever you have been tied tonight, may you be loose. In the name of Jesus. Jesus said to them. Because Jesus has finished his own. Spiritually, Jesus has brought him alive. And Jesus said, This is your handwork. You, these people, you are the one that tied him. Losing. Every work of human being alive, and hand has come to them today. Can you hear me? Say, I go me. Jesus shouted and said, Lose him! Jesus said, Yes, we pay a two. Hey, brother, lose him for what? A two fukini. Jesus said, Lose him and let him go. Yes, we pay a two. A jack your man, Lord. Jesus is interested in your going. Yes, we need to see the Lord. Jesus is interested in your movement. Yes, we need to see the Lord. Yes, we need to see the Lord. Hey, any power of stagnancy in your life tonight? Seven time wherever you are shall be broken by fire. Be broken by fire. Be broken by fire. Be broken by fire. Be broken. Say amen. Amen. So Jesus is interested in your rising. Is interested in your business. And let me tell you this. What Jesus has demonstrated here is a, is a repetition or was a repetition of what, G, of what God has told Moses. In Exodus chapter 5, verse 1. Don't forget, God told Moses. Tell Pharaoh. Let my people go. I am standing here tonight. Every power that is holding you down. That you have all manners of ideas. You have knowledge about your business. You have 
the certificate. You have all those things that will have helped you to rise. But yet, you couldn't experience that rising. Tonight, I am standing. God is losing you and is releasing you. I say he's losing you and he's releasing you. In the mighty name of Jesus. God said to Moses, Tell Pharaoh, Let my people go. The same word that God sent through Moses was the same word that Jesus was using here. In the case of Lazarus, what does that have to tell us? Hey, we must be a Bible reader. Jesus, Jesus. Had, he had the understanding of the word. Can you hear me? He knew how God sent Moses to set his people free. The same word was the one that Jesus was quoting. Lucy, let him go. The same word. Moses. Moses. Go and tell that wicked king. Let my people go. I am standing here tonight. I am quoting the same word. You are loose tonight. From that sicknesses. From that trouble. From that whatsoever, you are loose. If you are there, perhaps you are there. You have not been walking before. Oh, the first Perhaps you are there. You have defect. You have defect. In one way or the other, before. Tonight, because my father in the Lord has laid his hand on me, there shall be an outstanding miracle tonight. How many of you believe God with me tonight? How many of you are joined faith with my faith tonight? That, that impossibility is going to be possible tonight? If you agree with me, shout on common hallelujah. May it happen to you in the mighty name of Jesus. I'm rushing tonight. In Psalm 35 verse 27. Psalm 35 verse 27. Look at what the Bible says. Let them shout for joy. Let them shout for joy. And be glad. And be glad. That favor my, my righteous cause. Oh, yes. Yea, let them say continually. Yes. Let the Lord be magnified. Uh -huh. Which he had pleasure in the prosperity of his servants. Who has pleasure. what? Pleasure. In what? In the prosperity of his servants. Oh. Who are the servants of the Lord tonight? Hello? Listen, the Bible says the expectation of the righteous shall never be cut off. Do you know when they say the expectation? Who are the expectants? Another word for the expectant, you can call them the waiters. And that's why the Bible says in Isaiah, the Bible says, them that wait upon the Lord. Isaiah 40, 31, it says, them that wait upon the Lord, that he shall renew their strength. They shall mutter wings as eagle. Can you hear me? Okay, let me tell you. What does waiter does? When you see waiter, waiter serve. They serve. When you go to 
in supermarket. You see a waiter standing for you. As you are arriving, he will open the door for you and close it for you. Because he's a waiter, their duty is to serve. Brother, if you are one of the righteous tonight, that righteousness will never be completed until your works are seen. In the attitude of becoming a waiter. A waiter. Who are the waiters? Those that serve. In that department where you are. What are you doing? Hey, brother, don't tell me that you are a member of a particular ministry. If you don't have any service, if you don't have any service, if you don't have any role that you are playing, and let me tell you this, I am talking prophetically. Being a member will not save you on the day of judgment. Hey, be a member of a particular ministry. Will not save you. But your ministry will save you. Your ministry. What are your ministry tonight? Because by your ministry, God will identify himself with you. By your ministry, there will be a relationship just like the man of God tonight is talking about the needs of the ministry. That is one of the ministry. There are quite numbers of the ministry in the church that you must identify yourself with. Maybe a welfare department, Sunday school teacher, choir department. As we are talking here, there are security outside. Hey, for you to be a servant, there must be a message that you are carrying. Can you hear me? I pray for you tonight. If you have not identified your ministry, under this ministry, tonight may the Lord open your eyes to see your ministry. In the name of Jesus, say amen louder. Amen. That reminds me of a woman who has been looking for the fruit of the womb for years. She's, she was seeking for prayer. But after the prayer, the Lord told me, go to your ministry. Go and join the choir. Can you hear me? Just as we are here tonight, angels are here tonight to distribute. But let me tell you, angel will not come to visit you, but they will come to visit you at your location. If you miss your location, you will miss your allocation. I, I say this tonight wherever you should be in this ministry that you have been joking with but you are just calling yourself I'm a servant of the law hey waiter without service can you hear me may the law open your eyes and about six months after, the woman came back. She said, Daddy, Only Daddy. I am pregnant. Moloyu. I said, thank God for you. For your... Why? Because you obey. 
Why? Because you obey. Father, I pray tonight. Everyone that is under my voice. That are member of this ministry. But they don't have any service. Because in the service of God, God will service your destiny. I am standing here tonight. May the Lord open your eyes. I can't hear your amen. Amen. So the Bible says, God take pleasure in the prosperity of his servant. He takes pleasure in the prosperity of his servant. Which means he wants you to be moving from one platform to the other. So tonight, no matter that situation or circumstances that surround you, that promise of God will come to pass in your life. Say amen louder. Amen. Zechariah chapter 9 verse 12. Look at this wonderful testimony of these great people. The Bible says, the Bible is talking. He says, return to your stronghold. Oh, prisoners of, of hope. hope. Evil today. But sir, all the Bible scholar tonight, a prisoner on day. A prisoner. Oh, day. A prisoner is a man that everything about him has been resisted. He has lost his freedom. He has lost his whatsoever. Are you here tonight? But yet the Bible still says, return back to your stronghold. Because of their returning. The Bible called them, O ye priest, prisoners of hope. Prisoners of hope. I don't know what I can say about you or me tonight. If a prisoner is tagged with hope, how much about me that I can walk around? Tonight I prophesy that your hope in God it will not suddenly disappear. I say it will not suddenly disappear. And look at, because they return to God, the Bible says, even today, today, do I declare, even today, today, the Bible says, I am declaring that I will restore double. How many? Who are them that are waiting for double miracle tonight? Double miracle? You are waiting for double? A prisoner. God said, I will return. Hey, what the enemy has taken away. And I will give you double. I will give you double. Tonight, may the Lord give you double. I said, may the Lord give you double. In the mighty name of Jesus. Look at the Bible says. It will take us out of the pit. Where is it taking us to? So that we can be going to that direction that he has made for us. I pray for someone tonight. Psalm 68 verse 6. The Bible says, He lead prisoner into prosperity. Into what? Prosperity. Lord, I am standing here as your servant. Coupled with the grace of God of Baba Bina upon my life. 
I pray for everyone tonight may the Lord lead you into prosperity prosperity of ideas prosperity of miracles prosperity of testimony Oh, who are they tonight? I want you know You will catch one before you go. Home. If I'm talking sense to you, shout on common hallelujah. Hallelujah. Brother, if God is interested in our going, be no alone about the care test, what could have suddenly caused? Or that could have made us to find ourselves in those circumstances or situation of being tied. Of being tied. That you have the idea you want to do this, but you just find yourself that you couldn't do that. Let me tell you three things that could have caused that. Number one. That could have caused that. Are you there with me? Number one. It might it might be by prophecy. By prophecy. I'm rushing because I want us to engage in a warfare tonight. Are you there? There is a story of a man in John chapter 9. The Bible says, when the disciples saw the man, with the lesson and the message that they have been taught, they were asking Jesus, look at this blind man. And he's still a lad. He's still a lad, a boy. He's still a boy. But Jesus, tell us, Jesus, who has seen? Is it him? Or the father or the parent? Can you hear me? And look at, look at the reply of Jesus. He said, neither him or the parent. But what you have seen upon him, is for the manifestation of God's glory. So I am standing here tonight. That's that circumstances of yours. It will cause heaven to rejoice tonight. So that when you get old. People will begin to ask, uh -uh, what has happened? Oh. And people will say, ah, don't you know, he, he or she has gone to that program, Baba Binani. So you are rising tonight. Who is getting that miracle already? If you are getting it, say, I am getting it. I say, if you are getting it, say, I am getting it. That is by prophecy. It's not that the young man has done anything. But for the glory of God to be seen. Another one happened in Genesis chapter 15, verse 30. Genesis, you know, when God was telling Abraham that your descendant will go into another place entirely to a land that are not them, that are not meant for them. And they are going to be enslaved. And who was Abraham? Abraham Abraham was a, was a friend of God. Abraham There are quite numbers of things that must happen to you. That you won't have an answer for. It's not because of, of your sin. It's not because you have done something wrong. But only God can understand. Can you hear me? 
a friend of God and the next thing he can benefit from serving the law is for God to tell him your descendant they will go into bondage for 400 years <laughs> it's not a good news at all but that is God for you can you hear me that is God for you. You know, humility is not when you are prostrating or kneeling down for somebody. Humility is how you undo a matter that is standing against you. If Abraham was not an humble man, he would have rose up and faced God. So this be my reward from you? Why am I your friend? Why are you telling me my descendant? But Abraham kept his mouth shut. Abraham, I am standing tonight in the capability of the Lord's ability. Whatever it may be that you are going through, it will come to an end tonight. Am I making sense at all? You want me to continue or to stop here? I throw this bullet to someone. You will rise up tonight. I said you will rise up tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. I said why? Why? I may find myself in that circumstance. It, it might be by prophecy number two. It might be by sin. It might be by sin. Jeremiah 25 verse 8 to 14. It's all about the story how the people of Israel or the Israelites were enslaved for, four, for 70 years in, in Babylon. Babylon. Not because of anything. It was because of their sin. God has been warning them, but they never turned. And because of that, they bear the consequence. The consequence was that to go into slavery for 70 years. Any evil background tonight that want to put your back on the ground. I nullify it in the name of Jesus. I said I nullify it in the name of Jesus. Look at, look at another one. The journey of the people of Israel that will have cost them just 11 days. If you go with Deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 2. Or, but if you want to go with number 13 starting from verse 1 to the end or you read Deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 28 to 40 that has to do with the spy that, G, that, that Moses sent they came back with evil reports but Caleb and, and, and uh, Joshua they came with good reports because of their sin what is the nature of that sin sin of unbelief the Bible says God was angry. The journey that will have caused them for 11 days or for 40 days because the spy went and they came back for 40 days and the Bible, the God was angry. It cost them 40 years. I am standing on behalf of someone tonight that you are suffering from that 
a sin of unbelief. And because of that, you have been stagnated. I set you free tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The, the third reason. The third reason. Why you can be stagnated or you can be tied by the end. By ignorance. By ignorance. By ignorance. Hosea chapter 4 verse 1 verse, uh, it says four six rather my people are destroyed you see four six for lack of knowledge ignorance is a disease and it kills it kills. It kills. I am standing here tonight. Every spirit of ignorance that is affecting your innocent life. Tonight, the Lord will trouble them in Jesus' name. I can't hear you. I said the Lord will trouble them tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Look at First Chronicles chapter 12, verse 32. You, look, you, you see the children of Issachar. Because of their wisdom, they were not ignorant. The Bible says they have the understanding of the time. Because of that, they have knowledge. They know what Israel doesn't know. So I am standing here tonight in that class where you will find yourself. You will get First class. I said you will get for class. Your children will get first class. Your family will get first class. Who is that woman that cannot walk? I am standing here right now. I command your leg, I command your nerves, I command your body chemistry to respond now. You will stand up and you will begin to walk. I have told you I'm a member of this family. Baba Bina is my father Baba in the Lord. And lion began lion, brother. Can you hear me? Can I throw something by faith tonight? I take a key from this progressive altar to everyone that want to move progressively. Take a key of progressive. Who is ready tonight? Now I am entering into prayer session. Devil, you are in trouble. The day you discover yourself and you know whom you are, devil will leave you and your children. Are you set tonight? Get up wherever you are. You know, I have told you the three things why you my find yourself or meet yourself in that realm of being tight. Now, I have three prayer points. And I'm going to share with you three things needed that your life and my life require. 
that if I thought that I have been tied before, or perhaps you have been tied, as we are going through these three things tonight, the Lord will set me free. How many of you believe that God can set you free? You believe? Oh, my God. Hey, you believe? Oh, my God. About two months ago, oh, she made you say, we were doing night VG. And she is all doing the night VG. You know, it's all we, Pastor Falade, my friend. You know, see, Allah, no, Falade, or Remy. We were praying in my room. And that one, you know, Yarami. And as we were praying, we are saying, God, you are. Fire descended. In a socale. Hear me. Egbom you. The cloth that I wore. A shorty mo wore. Was sparking fire. On Obanaje. Doctor Faraday's driver. Everybody. Everybody in my home came in. In fact, the police, the secret, everybody in my they came in. It has never happened to me before. I had never had that kind of experience. Fire was, and the next thing when I sat on the bed, fire was sparkling on the on the bed. Me and Father, we began prayer again. Oh, and the doctor, Pastor Komele, he said, I had that experience they told me. Last month, he came and we were doing the prayer. Do you know? The same thing is happening. Do you know? The same thing The same miracle happened. The same miracle happened. Brother, let me tell you this. There is, there is power in the name of Jesus. Can I say something tonight? That powerful man that is holding your blessing. Oh, Bami. You cannot hear me. Mm, you don't understand. Sometimes I was preaching in the church. God told me. Allah will suffer me. And he said, row three. Oh, we pray in Laketa. Look at the woman there. And I was looking. I saw a gun in the hand of the woman. And I said, God, what is this? He said he's going to shoot you. Shoot me. What am I going to do? Devil, you don't cast out, we cast you out. And I said, God said, there is a woman here. That you carry a gun and you want to shoot me. And I said, oh, sir, and they, they brought her out. out. When she came out, she began to speak in tongues. I said, no, I'm not asking you to speak in tongues. We want to talk. God said to me, when I was preaching, what are you doing in the realm of the spirit? She said, daddy, I will kill you. And I said, God said, in two days to come, God said, I should tell you that God will ridicule you. And we close the service. Second day, the woman was bathing. She said a tall man entered to a bedroom. And he told your car to own it deliver. Say amen. Men of God. I am a member of this family. Whether you like it or not. 
I'm a member. When I ran, I traveled here. here. When I perceive that my, my, my fire is going down, I have my way. You just see me at Baba place. I know how to prostrate very well, to lie flat on the floor. I can lie down flat. I'm still going flat. there. What? Nothing. I just want to greet you, Daddy. I can be in his house tonight. I only need a word. I raise my hand up tonight. All you write out that the word is cementing. You will share testimony tonight. <laughs> Say hey, man. Amen. The woman was bathing. Angel went in. And the woman ran out. She ran to the church nakedly. And the next thing, the security. They had him when she was confessing. And they tied him down. Once they tied they, her down. Once they, and uh, they called me. They said something has happened in the church. Oh. They said, so, so, woman, that you are speaking to on Sunday. And uh, she said, I am not the only one that want to keep prophet. There is another lady. She mentioned another lady. What's the name? She mentioned, is it, uh, what's the name of the sister? Sister in the, uh, I can't remember. Again. And I said they should go and call the sister. When they brought, what's her sister? Yemi. 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 They brought the sister. The sister looked like a coin. And the sister said, eh -huh. Oh, are we in the meeting? You know, Is it not you that reported prophet? You are called Epi Woli Suni. But the federal song for the loan. Everybody that you have reported in their meeting. What jab you put in for the book? They will be condemned because of it. They will be condemned because of it. It was that day. That I saw, and I had the experience of the word that says, Hold thy peace. Why I fight for okay. you. I was, I was sitting down and hearing them what they have done in my absence. Prayer number one tonight. Are you there? Are you there? Hey! Prayer number one. Say any accuser. Uh, hey, oh, Bomio. Louder and clear. That is accusing my household. What are you waiting for? Three times, say, be exposed. I see you I see I see you I see you I see you I see you In Jesus' mighty name, yes, we are the pray. Amen. The, the next prayer. Why is You will see the result of part tonight. Are you there? 
Share one bed. Listen. When you release the word through prayer, the Bible says, John 1 1, in the beginning, was the word. And the word was with God. And God was. Am I talking to someone? Look at the Bible says, Psalm 1844. Only as soon as the year of my voice, do you know the trouble of, 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 of our people? They don't hear our voice in prayer, but they hear our voice during the trouble. They don't hear our voice. During the revival. For they hear our voice during all manners of battle. To understand that our neighbor will have noticed. That is why they are hearing them. But Bible say, as soon as they hear of my voice, as soon as he's talking about the time. When the year of my voice, the stranger submit. Jeremiah 18, 18 says, Prophet are knows by the word. Can you hear me? How to know a prophet is by the word. And John 17, verse 8. Jesus said, The word that you have given unto me, Father, I have given it unto them. It is the word. If you don't carry the word, you die for the word. There was a storm. Jesus was wake up. They woke him up. And because Jesus carried the word, this storm became. John was woke up likewise. But he carried no word. He said, if you want this storm to be calm, throw me inside the water. If you don't have the word, you die for the world. You will shout this. Are you set tonight? You will call the name of Jesus Christ. All those who are bringing bad news about my life, those who are reporting my life, are you, are you here tonight? Hey, Look at Isaiah chapter 8 verse 10. The Bible says, take counsel together. It shall come to naught. Speak the word. It will never stand. Can you hear me? There are people that are taking counsel together in your absence. But those things will not stand because... God is with you. If God is not with you, they will register their standing. Can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, Pariwolale. You are going to shout now. Are you there? Hey, righteous, my fault, seven times. But he must rise again. That's what the Bible says. Oh, You are going to shout. Whosoever. Ah, me borrow and win you. Look at those two people. They, they will have killed me. But thank God for the grace. Because I told Paris, and I told Rodu and Omar Ka. We are to confess. Loud and clear. Fighting against my destiny. Don't go my Boy, listen to this. One day, 
I call Baba. Baba. Baba pray with me. Baba, I do for me. That was in London. In London. I was going for a program. We want to open a new brand. And he prayed with me. After the prayer, God opened my eyes. I saw one of our headers. All of them, they are watching us through CFTV tonight. God said to me, The person that wants to kill you, sir, has entered London now. London by you. The man said, the person, I'll manage. I said, I saw a woman. You need to pray. Where, where are you? I said, come, come, come. And he came. We held our hand together. Brother, there is power in prayer. There is power in prayer. If prayer will not be answered, people will have stopped praying. Before I was born, prayer had been said. If prayer had not answered, they will have seen the answer. There is nothing there. We pray together. After the prayer, God told me, Go home. Lord, he was going home in the UK. He got to the bus stop. And he saw the woman that God was talking about. And he said he was dodging the woman. The man called me. It's a story that Pastor Komalein knows. He knows the man I'm talking. The man called me. That woman you are talking about is now at the bus stop. The woman without visa, without passport. passport. How did you get to UK? When we are talking of spiritual, hey, if you play with it, you go for it. And uh, the man left for his house. When he got home, the next morning, his neighbor, who is a white man, called him early in the morning. He said, I saw an old woman that was leaving your home by five o'clock. And the white man described everything about the woman. The other called me, Woli. Prophet, this is what has happened. I said, no. I said, he will be wounded already. Every problem that follows you will be wounded. The problem will be solved. Alone will promise you. God did not promise us that you will have a journey without storm. Uh, 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 uh. John 16, 33 was in the world. It was the direct word from the mouth of Jesus. That you may have perfect in peace the in the world. Thou shalt have tribulation. But be of good cheer. He said, I have overcome the world. He said, you have overcome the wall. Whoever wants to show me the wall, we die for it. Because I am with that person who has overcome the wall. Brother, brother, the second day, in the hometown of that Eda, the woman confessed. Only a gun gun red hand long would the daru kwe da wani yuke. He mentioned our head and said the bone has been And the woman died. Obi ni asi ku. Olu abi mobani ipe. Lord, if I have the call, moso ma ipe baba abi na. I hang on the call of Pastor Abi. Mo gweni to son kon la wala wala. Everybody that is weeping now. Mo gweni to ji olu do do ti yanje. Every righteous that is suffering. Egbo rolo nuni asala yo. Go to na. God will wipe your tears away. (laughs) 
Ogba, you will pray this one. Can you hear me? Why will I be experiencing the spirit of almost getting it? The best story you can share in your lifetime is that you almost take it. Every spirit of almost is gone tonight. Can I shock you? Your best is on the way now. The womb, that lady confessed. He said the bone has disturbed him from breathing. And it don't say your bone will disturb the person tonight. Pariwe suya The devil is mad. The devil is mad. Are you there? Say one more. The world. Oro na. Agbara to ngbe nu oro. The power living in the world. So lower. Do you have hands? Mofeko pate wa ni oh magba o magba o. Listen, listen, listen. Magba, 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 magba. Listen. Hello, 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 hello. Listen. Koto magba, magba. Hello, please listen, listen. Oh, pate wa ni ni ba. Fifteen. You clap fifteen. Only come wa manja de la nu eba ipe. The sound will come out from your mouth, dad. Oro tu ni si le o. Oro be mi di de. The second one. A cage. Can I tell you? Recognizing the position of an elder. Hey, it's very, very important. Very, very, very important. Listen. The Bible spoke. Look at the look at the sons of the prophet. Second King chapter six verse one. The Bible says. Look at five seconds. The Bible says. The two cancer together among themselves. And they came before the man of God. They says, sir. This place where we are. Is too small for us. Can I shock you? The rising of a ministry is not lying upon the leader. It's lying upon the followers. I don't know, maybe you are getting me. How far the ministry will go? It's not lying upon the leaders. So it's upon the followers. By a good followers, you see ministry moving. The man of God was he not in that? You want to tell me 
He's not seen it. He has been consumed for the things of the Lord. Things that has to do with spiritual matters. But it is wise men around him. That said, no, no, this place is too small for us. And they came with that suggestion. This place is too small. And then they said, we beg you. Or we beseech you. Release us, sir. Let us go and bring plank for the expansion. And the man of God granted their, pet, their request. But in verse 3, one of the wisest among them, they were going, you know, one came back and said, Sir, I beg your pardon. Follow us. Recognizing the position of an elder among you. You know, they were young people. They believe in their strength. They can cut the plank. But they never dream of what could arise spiritually. But wise man around them Come back and say, Sir, follow us. Follow us. And thank God that the man of God followed them. The Bible said their ass fell into the water. And he shouted, In time of trouble, young one will not hear your voice, the elder will hear your voice. Am I talking sent to someone? And that is why all the children hear your voice. Hear my voice tonight. If your parent offend you or has offended you, you are not a teacher to punish them. Can you hear me? That father, that mother. When you are young, when you are a baby, was he not taking care of you? Take care of your, care of your parent. You? I told you I won't be you. And even your parents in the Lord. I tell you I won't be you in all you are. The man scream. All the sons of the prophet were there. No one could attend to him. It was the elder that said, Show me the place. Why will you be fighting someone that will show you the way? I point to you tonight. I point to you tonight. All of you fighting with your parents. I beg God on your behalf. May the Lord forgive you tonight in Jesus' name. How many of you believe that something wonderful will happen and it's happening? You will pray this one. Can you hear me? I was traveling to my hometown. I got to Ibadan here. I was, I wanted to buy bread. And one old woman came around as if she was a bread seller. And uh, I gave her the money. And it has been part of me. I love giving. That's me. So I gave her money again. So we want to move. The woman, old woman. Old woman. People inside, they were so aggressive. When they wind down, when he glass leg, when he away love it better. Oh, he said, you will collect your right with your hand. When he me also need bread, you. He said, I'm not a bread seller. I'm a missioni. I was sent to you. And she told me three things. Oh, there's all matter for me that happen. Oh, matter to share it. Only where you are going, turn back. Only be told, Lord, but I say, Malo, Malo, don't go. Malo, do not go. Hey, I got your phone now, huh? The other that we show you the way, you will meet them in Jesus' name. Listen, I felt this like one faithful days. I just look okay. Abraham was just having a nice time in the front of his house. And the Bible says three angels were standing. One duro. Abraham stood up. Abraham did. He went there. 
and he pleaded with them. Please come to my house. Why is he begging? He was the one that would take care of them. He was the one that would give them whatsoever. And he was still offering that you are giving that lacks honor will never be accepted by God. Those three angels came in and they hurt with him. Why it, it was then? They were talking with them about their vision, about their mission. Do you know about evil Sodom and Gomorrah? They were telling Abraham about what they were about to do. Do you understand what I'm saying? Recognizing the position of an elder. Very, very important. Oh, Pariwolale. You are going to shout now. Oh, Pariwolale. You will shout now. Everyone that was sent to my life. I cannot hear you. Everyone sent to my life. One of the things that I'm benefiting and I'm enjoying is the grace of Baba. All my friend knows. Everybody that knows me knows. I always tell them, you are children, but me, as as I'm I'm me. Time, when I'm there, my guys are going to meet you because listen to me. If you are becoming wiser in the front of your elder, your help will not come speedily. I can't that. Can you hear me? Hey, because listen, listen. I'm very sorry. Everyone that is powerful will not easily relieve, relinquish their power. Go and study your Bible. They labor for, they labor for it. They have sacrificed. They have done. She funi. One she rubber funi. One she lala funi. For the mansion, I mean, for the for the grace to rest or mantle to rest upon anybody, it doesn't take. Easy like that. Elijah follow Elijah. Elijah tell Elijah. Elijah of Egbele. Elijah did not want to leave the power. It was sacrifice of Elijah. Elijah got it for him. Brother, if you want to tap something from him, sacrifice. Sacri Look at. Elijah follow. Elijah tell him from one city to another. And it came to a time when they crossed the river Jordan. It was then that Elijah got to know that this man is serious. He said, "Tell me, what do you want?" Elijah said, "Double person in this." Ah, Elijah ni Elijah ni look at you. Elijah said, "You." Is it so easy like that? That was so easy. I am going. And he said, I am going. Look at me. I am going. 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 I am Oh, when you are watching somebody, go to Bethsaida River. Go, Bethsaida. The Bible says when the angel came to the, the river the and, the river, and got the river steer, oh, the river that river. came or comes in and will to, be healed. So, so, me, can you hear me? Yes. You want power from me? Watch him very well. Hey. 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 You want to say, is it a ghost? No. <clears throat> Elijah tell Elijah. Elijah followed Elijah. Do you know? Say Elijah. Let me tell you this. Before Elijah, Elijah began to follow Elijah. Elijah, Elijah, Elijah was replacing someone. 
the the sons of the prophet that Elisha was replacing, where was he? He has spoiled his ministry because of food. When Elisha said, when Elisha said to him that God has sent me to go into another side, do you want to go with me? Three years. That person that has been following him, that has hunger, so if I don't say to my dad, I don't say to my dad. They want to move you down, man. He did not answer again. When Elijah was going alone, it was then that God said, "Oh, don't say that." So I'm going to let you know, Nico, that can you go down? It's not good that man should be alone. No, no, no. Okay, there, there is a man there. I couldn't come with him. That is working on his farm. Get him, let him replace. That sons of the prophet. Am I talking saying to someone? Recognizing the position of an elder. That's what I enjoy. When I know you carry the grace, we become friends. How do you When I know that you are a person that turning how to be a God chaser. Oh, because iron sapen iron. Am I talking sense tonight? Oh, oh, pariwo lale. You are going to shout tonight. You will shout. Elisha. Elisha. Man to rest upon. Elijah, man to rest upon Elisha. Akbara, Elijah. Obale, Elisha. Do you know? Yeah, my In the life of Elisha, you know, yeah, Elisha. Nobody could get the same thing. Could send to the bank, can I? It's not man to resting upon another. Is not lying on following alone. Big bag, bag, alone when he can. Could do all the work and tell the last one. Is on sacrifice. He rub all over, I'm up to tell over. Oh, party will lie. I'm gonna shout tonight. Oh, party will. You will shout. So we any elders. In heaven there are headers. Are you there? The Bible says in number. Number 11 2. The people of Israel crying to Moses. And Moses took their crying. To the Lord. Moses is very, very much all the way. And the Lord quenched the fire. All the way, the fire, no, no. That was affecting them. You not only come on there, can you hear me? Tell the Bible. Because the Israelites recognize the position of the elders. Sorry, but I want my side. You want that? They know we have to take their weeping to. One more reason why they move here, come on, Lord. And their fire was quenched. As the fire, no, no. And neither that you don't. You don't recognize. Am I talking to someone? Cannot bless you. Look at what the Bible says. Is there anyone among you that is sick? Let him go to war. Either you don't recognize to and you go to him that you sick. You have to cost your money. Say, I son is I thought you should have died. Hey, you need to recognize the position of an oh, elder. Yeah, Am I talking sense? If I'm not making sense, let me know, please. Oh, pariwo. I'm going to shout. You know, I'm a prophet to the glory of God. I preach as God is leading me. Can you hear me? I'm prophet and know by the word. Can you hear me? And the grace that God has given to me, God said, Why you are talking? People that hear you, He said, I will enter. And to the glory of God, I witness miracles in life. And something unbelievable happened. Can you hear me? Hey. Recognizing the position of elder. Oh, Baba, they know me. I'm Baba and Mommy. When I see them, I say, Ah, hey, Joe. I will see you after the service. Hey, Joe, I will see you after the service. Hey, elder, to for you, Tembelu. Hey, elder, you relegated. When you weep, it will not stop your weeping. 
Am I talking sense? You don't know my name. I am prophet. I have agreed. That's my name. Oh, We are going to shout tonight. Every other people who sent to me. Tonight. Holy Spirit, lead them into my life. Daddy, you want to see no you? Lead them into my life. Daddy, you want to see no One, two, pray. Oh, no, oh, no. Go, 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we are all pray. Amen. Look at the difference between David and Saul. David and Saul. David and Saul. David and Saul. Saul was anointed by a prophet. And likewise, David was anointed by the same Samuel. Samuel cannot love your David. But brethren. David was anointed three times. Number one, Samuel anointed him. Number two, men of Judah anointed him. Number three, the elders of Israel anointed him. After the elder anointed him, David entered into that promise of God. David, the one who I want to lay your you know. I'm praying tonight. I'm praying of elders on you. No, record just oh, you are going to be a They are fulfilled tonight. Prayers of elders, they are fulfilled for you. Monico Bess, this is any alley. They are fulfilled in your life. Bummy, listen. Look at John. I can never be compared with John. Very spiritual. Any meaning? I rated sand, prophet, sand whatsoever. In Revelation chapter 5, verse 5. If you can rest a when John saw something that beyond him, the Bible says he was crying. Because no man was found wanting to, to, to open the sea. But the Bible says it was one of the heads that, that went to John. Hey, and told him, John. Cry no more. 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 Cry John didn't see it. You are not ready. But another saw it. Allah balori. In that Monday, in the Agbari, we are Monday back on petesi kuleri. What the elder can see while standing, even if a young man climbs to the house here, he cannot see. I'm sorry, I'm sharing my experience. What I'm benefiting from. Oh, she had just been on the Monday and found it funny. Can you hear me? She had a bummy. I lift up my hand as a servant of the Lord tonight. Don't tell me so can be on a show alone. Ni a shalei. May ye you recognize your elder. I said, May ye you recognize your elder. In the mighty name of Jesus. The next prayer for you to come out of that. It's just for you to recognize whom you are. If you are offended, say, I am sorry. Can you hear me? If you have done something wrong, just to say, yes, Lord, I am sorry. That is confession. Confession brings possession. 
when you confess Romans chapter 10 verse 10 because with the heart man believes unto righteousness and with the mouth man confess is made unto salvation can you hear me? so by your mouth you tell God whom you are and I love God for one thing if you can say it out God is so merciful and he will say you are my son come back home somebody is hearing me tonight may the Lord forgive you as you are making your confession tonight in Jesus name Are you ready for this prayer? Any, any confession that I should have made that is incurring the anger of God upon my life. Father, as I'm making that confession tonight, let your grace begin to function upon me. Oh, you yeah, pray that Adura. prayer. Any confession I should have made that is in curing anger of the Lord upon my life. Lord, let your grace find me out tonight. Let your grace. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we are not praying. Amen. Out of Apostle chapter 3, verse 19. The, the Bible says, Repent, therefore. And be comforted. After repentance. After repentance. And you are comforted. Yes, The Bible says. It is then that time of refreshment. Will come from the presence of the Lord from the presence of the Lord. And that's why the Bible says in Psalm 16 verse 11. Can you hear me? In his presence there is fullness of joy. So I will not be surprised tonight because of the God of my father and the Lord. That somebody will experience the joy of the Lord tonight. Who are those people? Let me count oh, them. Yeah, 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 yeah. One, a thousand, two thousand, three thousand. I'm counting to fifty thousand. Lord, I signify. You will experience the joy of the Lord tonight. Are you set? Oh, a mimimo. Holy Spirit. The Lord just spoke to me. The Lord said, Somebody is here tonight. You cried before this program began. And you said, Where is the God of my Father in the Lord? The God of my Father in the Lord, Baba Bina, said, I should tell you tonight, you will not cry again. You will not cry again. I said you will not cry again. You know, when you confess and you are comforted, you will become a child of the Lord. Because only the children of the Lord will stand in his presence. And it is then that the Bible says in Romans chapter 8 verse 14, that those who are led by the Spirit of yeah, God are sons. 
and daughter of God. I stretch my hand to somebody. Before the end of this day, and into one in your own MIP or Jewel. We confess. He will confess. He will confess. As I'm closing now, let me tell you this. For you to be a child of the Lord. Isaiah 63 says something. Verse 8. Please, I want it for us, everyone. This is very, very important. Isaiah, Isaiah 68, 63, verse 8. For he said, Surely they are my people, children who will not tell lies. So oh. he became their savior. Oh, see, we pray. Lord, oh, any, I mean, oh. If you want God to be, be come your savior. Your savior. Oh, dear, look, that look, look. is the qualification that will you qualify you. Not, uh, Can you hear me? Say, like, me? And when this happened to you, be, like, be, like, be, like. look at the uh, benefit that you will reap. Uh, look at verse 9. Uh, sec, uh, son. In all, in how many of the afflictions? The Bible says, in all the afflictions, Jesus was afflicted. So, what you are going through as a son and daughter of God is not you alone. God is going with you. That insult that people are giving to you is not you only they are giving. They are giving it to God. He said, in all the affliction, he was afflicted. And the angel of his presence saved them. In his love and in his pity, he redeemed them. And he bore them and carried them all the days of old. Lord, I ask for a miracle tonight. Who needs a miracle tonight? You will call the name of Jesus three times. The God of Baba Bina. I need a miracle tonight. The God of Baba Bina. I need a miracle tonight. Listen, are you there? Are you there? After Elisha, Elijah has gone. When Elisha was coming, when he got to the bank of the river, because he is a son of God, he carried the credibility and the ability of God through sacrifice. Something, some, something so worried me. The 50 sons of the prophet, they were sons, they were sons, but they were sons for nothing. Can you hear me? You know, they were, when Elisha was following, in fact, they were ridiculing, ridiculing Elisha. Why are you following the empty man who is dead already. But Elisha will say, yes, I know. Hold thy peace. You know, when he, he was following him, the, sixth, the 50 sons of the prophet, they were not going back home. They were standing watching. Fifty sons of the prophet were watching. When they crossed the river Jordan, they were, they were there. When Elisha was coming, they were there. 
So when they saw the one that, that happened through the ministry of Elisha, they were the one that shouting. The God of Elijah has rested upon Elisha. But the word of God now. Anyone that is mocking you. When they will see the wonder of, of my father in the Lord, Baba Bina, tonight, they will say truly, the God of Baba Bina has done something. Who is taking that? Amen. Who is taking that? Amen. Am I talking sense? Look at that. That is the benefit of you becoming a true child of God. A true child of God. And listen. For you to be a child and to become a son. Because a child that refused to grow will become a disabled child. When a preacher is preaching, he's talking to two people. He's talking to the descendant of Jacob. He's talking to the descendant of Israel. Number 23, verse 7. Look at Balaam. The, the Balak. The wicked king. Somebody that never knew God. He said to Balaam, the empty prophet, he told him, Cause me Jacob. But entice Israel for me. Jacob can be caused. Who is Jacob can be caused. Who is Jacob? But let me go to the Bible. Who was Jacob? Jacob was a man, a pretender, a 419. Can you hear me? A man, can you hear me? That like taking something that doesn't belong to you. Don't, 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 don't. He took the birthright of his brother. And that is why his mother asked him to run. Because the mother knew what has happened between Abel and Cain. How Cain killed Abel. So for, for that not to happen again, he told Jacob, run. I can see the hunger your brother is chasing or after your life. So look at, that is Jacob. And everything that Jacob got under that name, he brought it back to Esau, his brother. That is restitution. That is restitution. What are those things that you need to restitute? Restitution is very important. The day I got to know all this, honestly, my life has never been the same again. That is restitution. Everything, when, he's, when he was giving it to his brother, the brother that had an experience of, you just... Uh, I, you gave me small food. And you took my bath right. What will happen if I take all this gift? He said, I don't have. I have enough. But he took it later. Restitution. That night was when Angel came and fought with Jacob. Night. And the Bible says, his name changed from Jacob to Israel. Jacob can be caused. If you are a Christian that is not standing right, devil has the right over you. 
But who are Israeli? Israeli are the children of God that had the understanding. They are matured. That's why Balak said, Balak, you can't cost by Israel. But you can lure the children of God into sin. They cannot be caused. When the children of God are lured into sin, the devil knows he did know the knowledge. Only oh, ye. It's not him that will fight. Oh. It is the law of God that will fight. Oh, can, you hear me? can you hear me? Tonight I pray for someone oh, in the house who are toying with the sin. And you don't fear. She, she, she. And who said, who with who can you move me? Ah, who will arrest me? Ah, ah, move badu and salai. Sin will not sink you. <laughs> As I'm dropping, you will call the name of Jesus three times. Oh, you are going to shout. Lord, deliver me from sin. Can you hear me? Deliver me, deliver me from sin. Deliver me from sin. Deliver tonight. Oh, you yeah, pray that prayer. Yeah. Pray that prayer. Deliver me from sin. Deliver me from sin. Pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we are not praying. Amen. What am I saying tonight? Your life must change. Word are not looking for a perfect man. But word is looking for a growing man. Somebody that will know this year confession. The next year we say, ah, ah, is he not the same person? Ah, he has changed. Brother, Brother Langbaja has changed in the choir. Sister Langbaja, oh, is now changed, a changed person. Paul says in 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 11, when I was a child, I spake as a child. I understood as a child. But when I grew I threw away all those tidings. Tonight, in the name of Jesus, the Lord deliver you from there. The Lord deliver you from childhood behavior. The Lord deliver you from childish behavior. Let me give you this rema. That nobody can take away from you. Can you hear me? Say the me. In Isaiah 45, verse 4. Please quickly give it to me. Isaiah 45, verse 4. Look at. For my Jacob, my servant's sake, and Israel, my elect, I have even called you by your name. I have named you, though you have not known me. Uh huh. I am the Lord, and there is no other, there is no God beside me. I will give you and tell you, you have not known me. Those are Jacob. God has so named them. But yet, they have not known God. And that is the benefit of when time comes, who are them that are ready to give their life. You are made by God, you are created by God. But Jacob didn't know. Can you hear me? Those are Jacob. Israel are the people that had the understanding. Israel, the surname they are carrying, they know it is God. When God bless them in the church, they use their blessing to raise the standard of the church. When God has given them whatsoever blessing, they will recognize God. They say, no, it's God that has done this. So I pray for someone like that in our midst. You are rising and rising. 
I said you are rising and rising. That is God that his son named you. Hear this one. In Isaiah 44, verse 5, this is for them. If God has not so named you, you have the right to give yourself a name. Can you hear me? Look at one who say, I am the Lord. Another will call himself. Who is calling him? He is calling himself. When times, when times are come to now and say, who is ready to give their life to yeah, Jesus? Call yourself. Another will call himself by the name of Jacob. Another will, 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 will what? Write with his hand. The law. And name himself by the name of Israel. Who is doing that? He's by himself. Another translation says, Another will raise up his hand by identifying himself with the God and surname himself. If God has not surname you, through confession, you can surname yourself. You can call yourself into righteousness. You can call yourself into the obedience of God. Look at that. Calling himself. Raise up your right hand. Raise up your right You will pray like this tonight. Say, Father. Baba. I am calling myself to now. I can't hear your voice. I am calling myself to now. Into the righteousness of God. Into the obedience of God. Father, Father make me yours. Make me your own. Pray that prayer. Lord, tonight, in the name of Jesus, I am calling myself to the glory of God. In the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we are not praying. Amen. Go home with this one. Oh. Revelation chapter 2 verse 17. This one, no witch or wizard can take it. Revelation chapter 2 verse 17. Look at. He said, read for me. He said, Let him hear. He who asks and hear, let him hear what the Spirit says to the churches. I will give what? To him, who I will give him some of any manner. I can hear you. And I will give him a white stone. On the stone, a new name written, which no one knows except him who received it. Listen, Wagbo, I will give him a white stone. And on the stone, a new name, a new name. written, yes, sir. which no one knows, knows. except. Who is him? Him. Do you know what that means? You have the password of your destiny. No one knows it until you give it out by yourself. God has given you. That's what he has said. And there's a repetition of that in Revelation 19.12. He gives you a name. Tosoma. But I know the If I continue to sin, I will give the enemy the password of my life. Samson was very powerful. Samson in lack but by before. himself, he gave the password of his destiny to his enemy. Now, where may you Can you raise up your two hands? Go, go password. I hear me to what the word. I will do a bapada. Go, go password. I hear me. Oh, my pastor. To what the word. I mean, I will do a bapada. Bring them back. I will do a bapada. Bring them back. 
I want to pray for you. And as I'm praying tonight, the God of my Father in the Lord will touch you. Father in the name of Jesus. Ah, your amen so small like that. Father in the name of Jesus. Every sick in the house receive your miracle tonight. Amen. Somebody that is waiting for testimony, get your testimony now. Get your testimony tonight. Get your testimony tonight. Those of you that cannot walk, I call the God of Baba Bina that I know. Stand up and begin to walk now. Begin to walk now. Begin to walk now. Every spirit that is standing against your kingdom, against the kingdom of your destiny, I come and scatter. I'm hearing something right now. Baba, can I say this, sir? Baba, I say this, sir. Can I say it? Taking saw. What God has just told me now. I said, can I say it, sir? In the capability of the Lord's ability. Because of the God of my father. I stretch my hand to those who are hearing me now. Everybody that is staying in your life. They should fall down now. They should fall down now. They should fall down now. Oya subulule. Oya subulule. Oya subulule. Oya subulule. Bogwe nyi, those of you that you don't hear good thing, when they share good thing, you hear it. It will just, it will not come to pass. Because of the spirit that you possess. Can you hear me? Because of that spirit. I cast it out now. I cast it out.
ko subula la yo ko subula la yo ko subula la yo emi olorun so fun mi pe the spirit of god told me gbugbu emi every spirit emire o so aje gbugbu iko agbara okun ko gbugbu every power of darkness to da ko mai pade yi loni that mix with this program tonight as god live it your lord tin be lie i plead the blood of jesus o be fun e je jesus hear me e gbo mi wherever you are i command you begin to come out here come out here in the name of jesus I am making the recourse. Oni emi to yato. You have a contrary spirit. Ibi kibi to bawa masari bota. We are run to the front now. Mo palace ibi kibi to bawa masaki ni. Anywhere you are. Masari gade bo. We are run to the front now. Can you hear me? Mo palace. I command you. Go masaki ni. Run to the front. We are never you are. Ibi kibi to bawa. Tonight is your night. Asale arele is a night of power. Asale agbara ni ma jade bo. Run to the front. Ere ni ko ma sabo o. To ba sare if you don't run ma jade bo. Sare si waju. Oni ni ojo igbara re. Today is the day of your salvation. Ma jade ma duro si beya. Stand in the front. Wherever you are. Ibi kibi ti o wa. Mo palace ni o. I command you. Ma jade bo. Run to the front. Ase orun ni ma je mo orun ni. Ebule decree. Ma jade bo. Run to the front. Mo palace ni oruko baba. I decree in the name of the Father. Ere ni ko mo sabo. You must run. Ere tete. Run. In the name of Jesus. Ni oruko Jesus. I'm still waiting. Mo si nduro di oko sara. Come on wherever you are. Ibi kibi ti o wa. Wherever Ibikibi ma ba ma ba ma ba ma ba ma ba run to the front run here run to the front run here run here I say this what you know ah olorun baba bi na o ma jade bo ni bi to ba wa run to the front ma jade bo sales what you wherever you are come out come out the god of abina baba bina is setting you free tonight is setting you free tonight. Is setting you free tonight. Where is that woman? Tiwani, you should kill your, you should kill your son. Where are you? Come out. Ojama, go man ya boki na to jola re. Ma jade ba. Run to the front. The God of Ababina is here tonight. Is here tonight. Is here tonight. I am still waiting. And let me tell you this. If you are there, you are not coming out. If I am a servant of the Lord, you will tear your clothes. You are maternal. The child they say you should kill. Ma gebo. Bring the child to the front. Eba mi ba manya lo wale. Eba manya wa. Eba manya wa. Take the child from her. Then go now divide pa. Bring the child to the front. Bring the child to the front. Ma gbe wa fun baba. Bring the child. Olorun baba bi na o. Olorun baba gbe fun baba. Give the baby to the front. Bo ma ye fun baba. Baba omo yin niyan. Ah, emi mi ma o. Holy Spirit. 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 Oh, emi mi ma o. Holy Spirit. Ma jade bo. Oya 
run to the floor. Wherever you are, come on. You are too many before the Lord will on you. The Lord of Baba will run ah, you. Oh, you will be surprised. Oh, you will be surprised. Come out. Come out here. Is he not God? Is he not God? Oh, Billy, there is a woman in the in the house. Oh, man, when you know do you swim in the river? Oh, but you when you do don't go see your to Leo. When you swim in the river, any man that see you, you go see your to Leo. Any man that see you, one man subusani, they will fall. You want a man to sit down? Yeah, you run to the Lord. You want before the Lord in His presence. The Bible says there is fullness of joy. There is what? There is fullness of joy. There is fullness of joy. Where is that woman? Run out here now. Oma when in Wodo. You swim in the river. Oma when Wodo. You swim in the river. Come out now. Run to the Come out now. Come out now. How many of you believe that God is able tonight? You believe God is able. Come out quickly. Come out quickly. You, you swim in the river. Run to the front. Run to the front. Glory be to his holy name tonight. Uh -uh. The presence of the God of The King of kings. Glory be to God in heaven. Ah, there is a woman in this meeting. Oh, Seven days before your death. Seven days before your death. We don't come out. Okay, hallelujah. Shout one, hallelujah. <laughs> hallelujah. Ah. Help me shout all on who Baba be now. Moni o pari walaru baba bi na o. Is it not wonderful? Oh, the Lord Almighty, we bless you in the name of Jesus. Ah, Olorun o ile iga la le yi o. This one is great to now. Obinrin kan wa nu pade. There's a woman in this meeting. Bi won se pariwo to ri sa kan wa to wa ninu le to. I say shout there you have an idol in your house. Ma jade bot. Come out now. To ri sa to ri sa yen. With that your idol. Yes. Baba ti gbadu afun o ti tan. Ah. He has prayed for that child. Oh one Give a book and if I walk in mini. One that he has touched the child. How much more mati baba gbe da ni late ka e gba lowo baba o ti tan. Where is that woman? Oh, you worship idol in your house. Biti, oh, yeah, come forward now. Today is your day of salvation. Father, glorify yourself tonight. Glorify yourself tonight. Where is that woman? Oh, yeah, come, 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 come. I'm waiting for you. Ah, God is wonderful. My my Run to the front. My Run to the front. Almighty God. Oh, God. Oh, Baba I worship you. I give you. Adoration. Baba Please help me. Let them be on one part. On one part. On one part. Oh, thank you, God of Bababina. This is another calling. You are here for the first time tonight. Oh, wow. You are not a member of Gospel Faith what Mission International. You are here for the first time. Oh, you have just come to taste the God of Baba Bina. You have just come to taste the God of Baba Bina. told me that I should pray for you. In the name of the God of Baba Bina. Come out, you are here, you are not ah, a member. 
You are not a member. Marble. Come to the front. Marble. You are invited to this program. Marble. Come forward for prayers. You are not a member. Emma Jadibo. Can you come forward for prayers? Olorun Baba Bino. The God of Baba Bino. Come out here. Visitors, come come out for here. prayers. Emma Abodi, what do you want Come out here. Emma Abodi, what do you want to do? Come Baba out here. Bina, oh, 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 oh. Alarun Baba Bina, oh, Mosheba. Oh. Ah! Moshe Baba Moshe Hey, Moshe ba tori pe ekwa dur. Eba miki alaru baba bina o Moshe ba. Eki alaru ti o yipo alaru baba bina o Moshe ba. Moshe ba tori pe ekwa dur. Ah, alaru baba bina o Moshe ba. Ife go fa uti o kunai lai lai lai. I like Moshe Batori pe ibadura Emi bi ma se o Emi a wo buli Emi bi ma se o Emi a wo buli Emi bi o tu la gbara wa Emi bi mo Emi o Emi bi ma se o Emi a wo buli Emi bi ma se o Emi a wo buli Emi bi o tu la gbara wa Emi bi ma se The God I know and my life is better. And the God of my life is better. So be In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I congratulate you tonight. You are invited and you came. You are invited you are congratulated. As you came here. I came, I met the God of this place. Your life has changed for better. Please. Say in one side. The last one. The last call. Ipe. So she get her. So you. Pray. You want to identify yourself with Christ tonight. Now what? It's okay. Raise up your hand. 
Oh, T ni Jesu. Ofe ni Jesu. Jesus. Na wo eso ke kin gbadu afun. You want to be saved. Ofe ri igbala. O ti jade o ti jade tele na na wo esi ta. O wa na wo ya na wo eso ke. You want to be saved? Raise up your hand. Gbogbo eyin ti e faye yin le fun Jesu te ese te faye yin le la lei. Those who have just surrendered your life tonight. Tori iyen gan lo je mi logunju ti n ba jise ni e mo gbe. That's my greatest concern. Lord God, that God, and it only a year to your own. Of somebody who owns heaven and earth. Oh my, be me lady. He will ask me. Oh, for a year left with Jesus. You want to give your life to Jesus? My possibility, my wife. I hear simple. Ni, oh, for a year left with Jesus. My boy, what do now? What do we? Oh, my God, my boy, my big boy. Oh, my God. You want to give your life to Christ? My boy, I want to give your life. My boy, I want to give your life. You want to give your life to Jesus? Once upon a time, the Lord of money has won. Oh, I'm back to you, oh Lord. You are the one living to be remembered. I'm back to you finally. I'm back. I'm back to you, oh Lord. You are the one living to be remembered. I'm back to you finally. Congratulations to those of you who have given your life to Jesus tonight. Your life shall never remain the same again in Jesus' name. 
Gospel faith measure is a show that believes in the totality of the word of God. We believe in the power of God. We believe in salvation. We believe in grace and many other things. I congratulate you for identifying with this church. Those of you who have submitted, I mean, who has given your life to Jesus Christ tonight, come to this side, move to this side. I want the ministers of God to attend to them briefly. I pray that your church shall be permanent in Jesus' name. Hello, please, please, please. Just give me two minutes. Just give me two minutes. Okay. Wait for two minutes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please, 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 please. Uh, prophet. Holy. We thank you very much. I know that you have very tight schedule. And because of your love for this church, let us all together pray for him and his ministry. Pray. He has blessed you tonight. Bless him and his family and ministry with your prayer. Can you pray? Can you pray? Can you pray? In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Jesus, Oluwawa. Prophet, we thank you very much for your love for this church and for your love for me. I thank you for your humility. As you humble yourself, the Lord will continue to lift you up Amen. and bless you. Amen. Bless your family. Amen. Bless your ministry. Amen. Bless those who support your ministry Amen. with what money can buy. Amen. And with what money cannot buy. Amen. If the Lord tarries, next year you will be here in Jesus' name. Amen. I want you to say, Prophet, we love you. As a boy, we love you. As a boy, we love you. 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 Our relationships shall abide forever. In the name of Jesus Christ. It is well with you. Amen. With your family. Amen. Your ministry. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen.